Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everybody. My name's In Harm's Way, and as you can see, this is World of Warships. Um, we don't have any containers, but let's start out by trying to get one in our Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Not a lot of Tier 10 players out there playing co-op battles. But I know for a fact I'm not ready for random battles in the Tier 10. Looks like we have a match. A couple of battleships, mainly cruisers. We have a Republic and a Grosse Kerr first, Salem, a Henry, or an Henri, since they are French, a Hindenburg, a Zao, a Moskva, and a Smolensk. Well, and they put us against a Salem, and the Salem against the one of the Henri's. Okay, Let's see what we can do. Go to here, mode enabled. then to Battle here. Starts. Give everybody else a chance to get out in front of us so we're not the first one sighted and shot at. Hindenburg is the next one that we might run into. We've made it past the Salem. This thing almost has battleship detection range. Or we can almost throw our Looks like that Henri might be the only one we can shoot at. Not have led that enough. I did not. All right, now we're getting hit from the front. That's Smolensk, man. He spammer. This Smolensk is trying to come at us. The ship is on fire. With his torpedoes. One fire we're not going to worry about. We get that. Curve first coming by us. Moskva coming at us. And 
no citadels. I don't think the Republic has any torpedoes. Does have big guns, though. Mostly over pens. Trying to knock out the mosque with guns, but I don't think I'm going to. Torpedoes dead ahead. Waypoint reached. Those should have been the Minos torps. But that's a win, and we didn't die. We caused 42 531 damage, got 876 experience, one sunk, 27 hits, one set on fire, 30 secondaries. We were second to last on our team, be the gross curve first right, right above us, but it's still a win. Alright, so... Huh. Clan battles only, but I haven't even made it to the clan battles. That's next. I have eight battles left to even get there. Let us take our Wakataki. Huh. We've been invited to a clan, but we don't have that yet. Let's see what the clan looks like. Research centers decent. Design bureaus decent. Shipbuilding yards decent. Dry docks. Coal ports got one. Steel ports got zero. I can do one. Academy's pretty high, so you get better commander's points. We're at one of four. This is a new clan, maybe? It's got a number of players in it. 32 of 35. Zero clan battles. 29 rank battles. Zero team battles. You know, this is something, we're not going to make a decision on this yet, but we're going to, we're going to hold on to it for now. Let's take our walkie-talkie out. See, lower tier, you get in a lot quicker. Alright, so a Friant, which is a uh, Tier 3 cruiser. Tier 2 Chester, Dresden, Dresden, Dresden. Tier 3 Valkyrie, Valkyrie, Wakataki, and a Tier 2 Longhang. 
Alright, well, looks like this is uh, fairly... Four of us in destroyers. I don't believe I'm pink. Action stations. We're gonna go here. Engine boost activated. To here, to here. We're gonna do that as fast as we can. should run into, not run into, but we should see and be detected by, there it is, right there, Valkyrie in front of us and a Wakataki. like I uh, died. That wasn't a very good battle. Well, let's see how the rest of our team does. Well, that Wakataki didn't do very good. How about this Valkyrie? Against the Long Zhang, and the Long Zhang can't torpedo him, so... Single torpedoes from the British ships. Nobody's concentrating fire on our on the Long Shang. Oh no, I guess the Dresden is. Jank's down, now the Dresden took out the Dresden, and our Valkyrie is, oh no, I guess our Valkyrie took out the Dresden. No one is my name. Seems to like the single torpedo shots. Which there's nothing wrong with. That's that's what British destroyers or Commonwealth destroyers are known for. Is those single torpedoes. Dresden, the Chester almost in our base, Dresden in our base, Chester getting to it. Two bots on our team, one is still alive. Maybe we should try and get this. Try and get the British destroyer line.
Residence done. Chester. Hit by one torpedo. Missed by a second. Nice. Let's let's work that line. Uh, victory 357. We didn't do crap to assist our team. Although we were not the bottom, we were second from the bottom. Let's see, British line. The Black Swan. We haven't even gone to the second tier of the Black of the British line. So we need 70,000 coins for the Weymouth and then 650 experience for the Medea. Heavy cruiser line. Hmm. I think we're going to stick it out here. Let's uh let's go to our Izokazi. Let's take her out. We have 505 experience. We need 1600 for the torpedoes. Slower reload but greater damage. We need 1,100 for the B, which gives us a second, uh, fourth turret. We might actually try to get that first. Let's see if we can survive longer in this one than we did in the last one. Three aircraft carriers. Uh-oh. Hopefully we don't see a lot of aircraft carriers. Uh, tier 4 with... One aircraft carrier on the other side, an Orion, Kawachi, Akuma, Caledon, Caledon, Bogatur, an Izokazi against us. And we're better in everything except concealment than him. And a Wix. Okay. Let's see what we can do with this. So we'll head straight out from where we are, and we'll hang a right, I'm sorry, we'll hang a left around this island right here, which is that island right there, nope, it's that island right there. So we'll hang a left around that island, and then keep circling around this area, see what we can find. Wait until we're seen by the Hosho's aircraft. Should be pretty soon. We should start firing at it. Yep, there it is. And then speed up. Engine boost activated. All right, so there's the enemy is Okazi.
Somehow we hit him with one of our dwarves and sunk him. Caladon has torps of its own. We don't want to run into any of those. Kuma just ran into our ship. Engine boost deactivated. Our team has taken the lead. Battleship Kawachi. Man, those aircraft are just all over me, aren't they? We're not doing crap as far as damage to them. Wow, we finally shot one down. Our torpedoes are seven kilometer and it's going away from us. It's not going to help us. Let's go back here and let's harass and harry the Hoshu. Hoshu's also going away from us. What we don't want is the Hoshu secondary to start firing at us. Hoshu is a fast ship. done very little damage to her. And it's been my experience that you have to get right up on them to do good damage or for them not to miss torpedoes. See what I'm saying? The torpedoes went right by it. Engine boost activated.
Well, we were able to hunt down and kill the carrier. At tier four, that's not as difficult as at tier, at any of the other tiers. And it helps that the carrier wasn't driven by anybody, anybody in particular. Uh, we got three kills, top of our team. Um, three sunks, one aircraft down. Uh, 773 experience, 54k damage, 24 target hits, 6 torpedo hits, 2 cause floodings, 1 aircraft shot down, 2 incapacitations, 3 destroyed, and 1 set on fire. Nice. Now let's take a look at our modules. We've got 1200 so we can get the... We can research the body and get better AA defenses and more survivability. by 1300 nice and says oh so we've got another turret cool all right so let's take the tenru out or let's look at the tenru we've got everything we need on the tenru here we can get the kawachi we're we're at a point now where we can research the kawachi we've got a vacant slot and we could purchase four more slots we also have a kuma that we're not even close to at this point. Tenru are, has seven kilometer torpedoes. Kwachi is the battleship. She's got four guns. Two on the side, so you can only ever, oh no. See these two on the side? You can only ever fire four at a time because the other two would just park. I don't remember what this style was called. Dreadnought of the Imperial Navy, sufficient fire or powerful armor belt, fire control were strongly affected by the diversity of calibers of her guns. She had insufficient horizontal armor protection and weak torpedo protection. Let's let's research her. That way, we're not going to purchase her yet. We're going to go back to the Tenru, and we're going to work on researching the Kuma so that the Tenru can get the, uh, forgot what it's called, but it's better for us because it has that wreath on it. Let's see, if we sort by... Elite. It's an elite ship. All right. So let's let's take the Tenru out to battle. Um, and for those of you who are joining us from YouTube, I hope you enjoyed today. My name is In Harm's Way. I do this every Wednesday, or at least I try to do it every Wednesday. Every once in a while, I get a wild hair up my butt and I do uh, something different. But for the most part. World of Warships Wednesdays is what we're looking at. And uh, if you're not a subscriber, please consider subscribing. A like is always appreciated. And we'll talk to you next time. My name's Tim Harms Way. I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.